All right, today I'm going to give you guys a detailed look at this um, Play Arts Kai Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker. And the figure I'm showing you guys is the Snake Battle Dress version. And uh, here's the box, and here's the figure. And on the back of the box, you see a couple of pictures of Snake, Big Boss, and the uh, interchangeable head. And also, uh, when it says uh, Miller, the other figure that's available in this line. And uh, let's take a look at the figure itself. Alright, and here's the figure itself. Uh, I took the liberty uh, liberty of giving him the, uh, the helmet head instead of the regular snake head. Um, here are the other accessories. He does not come with a here's base. the machine gun and uh, there's a bipod there, a working bipod. That's kind of cool. And he has a, he comes with a trigger finger and yeah, the other two. Here's a gripping one and then here's a relaxed one. And uh, he also comes with this pistol. And it does not come with a suppressor. And he also comes with this uh, bazooka, which he's holding right now. And uh, let's take a look at the figure itself. Here's a look at the figure itself and uh, the visor. It can come down as well. But uh, right now you could get a good look at that head sculpt. You can see the eyes. Looks nice and it says uh, the, the shield, uh, the, the visor. It's a translucent plastic. Here's what he looks like with the, the shield down. Rest of his armor. He got a couple of really big pouches. Two canisters, then a couple of ammo pouches. And on the side, this uh, shoulder pads. Let's see here, there's an insignia right there. And I believe on the other side it says Fox on it. Let me see if it's right. That is correct. It says Fox. And the rest of him. Great looking figure. Uh, you might still be able to find this guy. Uh, I picked it up at a comic shop um, uh, for 50 bucks actually. And uh, I picked it up uh, maybe three weeks ago. So this guy is still out there. But the uh, majority of the Play Arts Kai figures, uh, especially the Metal Gear, Metal Gear Solid ones, uh, they are getting sold out fast. And on the secondary market, they are getting very, very pricey too. So here's the back of him. And here we have Big Boss with his uh, regular head. Good look at it. Head sculpt. I think they did an amazing job on this, along with all the other um, Metal Gear head sculpts that they have done. I think all the Metal Gear ones are really, really impressive. And uh, here's this machine gun that he's carrying. As you can see, it's uh, kind of awkward the way he's holding it because. Uh, Back uh, for this figure, they didn't really give him that uh, uh, that shoulder swing out joint where his whole uh, arm could swing forward. Uh, so he, with his armor, especially how the bicep is, you can see how big it is. Kind of, it kind of uh, blocks uh, his uh, articulation a little bit, the range of motion, the range of movement a little bit. Uh, so he can't really uh, he can't really swing his arm forward too much. But here he is holding on to that weapon. Pretty awkward position. Nonetheless, he's holding it with two hands. 
He could actually do a better job with the, the bazooka. Let me show you. Something I don't like about uh, Play Arts Kai figures uh, are these, uh, uh, the way they made these uh, double jointed knees. Um, they're a ratcheting system, but uh, I think it's the way they, they glue them together. It's not totally solid. Alright, from the back here, you can see there's a seam uh, going straight down the middle between two pieces. Uh, I guess they didn't glue it down too properly. Uh, all the glue they use uh, aren't that good. So you can see how his legs kind of wiggles if I move him a little bit. That kind of sucks, but uh, I mean the ratcheting joint still works, but uh, it is a little bit of a uh, loosey-goosey here. Here's a nice pose of a uh, snake uh, adjusting adjusting the, the scope for this bazooka. Very nice indeed. And uh, yeah, so if you want, you can definitely give him this pose, which is a really, really nice pose. So let's go over articulation. Alright, as far as uh, Big Boss's uh, articulation, uh, head is on the ball joint, and then uh, shoulders a ball hinge. Bicep, there's a swivel, there's a cut joint right here. And then uh, we have these uh, ratcheting ball hinge uh, shoulders, I mean, uh, ball hinge uh, elbows, ball hinge wrists. Chest, there's a ball joint. Waist, there's a ball joint. And then uh, the hips are ball jointed. And uh, the thighs, there's a swivel joint hidden right by the hips area, but uh, you can't see it. And then uh, double jointed knees, a ball hinge ankles, and that's it. And this figure stands about 10 inches in height. So overall this is a good solid figure, but there are minor problems with it. If you could look past that, then you would definitely enjoy this figure. So there you go. Thanks for watching.